people go to the hospital or a clinic for a wide range of reasons. Today, you're going to learn what these reasons might be and things you or your doctor might say. Medical emergencies, a heart attack, a stroke. A heart attack is different from a stroke. A heart attack is an obstruction in the heart or in the heart vessels that causes damage. And a stroke is an obstruction or bleeding in the vessels in the brain that causes damage. Most people don't know the difference, so you might hear them say, I think I'm having a heart attack, or I think he's having a heart attack. He needs medical attention, severe injury, sudden illness, send an ambulance, accidents and injuries. I think she broke her leg, ankle, arm, hand, neck. I've fallen and I think I've broken my leg, ankle, arm, hand. You fractured your leg. Types of bone fractures, transverse, linear, oblique non-displaced, oblique displaced, spiral, green stick, comminuted. He's been in a car accident. She severely burned herself. The doctor will do a medical evaluation and then discuss the treatment. Severe pain or discomfort. Chest pain. My chest hurts. Abdominal pain. My stomach hurts. Headache. My head hurts. Or, I have a migraine. Your pain may indicate an underlining medical condition. We'll run some tests. Respiratory problems. I'm having trouble breathing. He's having an asthma attack. She has pneumonia. He has the flu. Infections. Urinary tract infection. You have a urinary tract infection. Skin infection. Chronic medical conditions. You have diabetes. You have type 1 diabetes. You have type 2 diabetes. Hypertension. Heart disease. Asthma. This will require monitoring and management. You must take this medication once a day. You must take this medication twice a day. Three times a day. Every other day. You must take this medication in the morning before you eat. You must take this medication with food. Take this medication after you eat. Don't drink alcohol while taking this medication. Diagnostic tests and procedures. We'll do an x-ray. We'll do a CT scan. We'll do an MRI. We'll run a few laboratory tests. We need to do a biopsy. Surgical procedures. This is an elective surgery and insurance won't cover it. We had to perform an emergency surgery. This is an invasive surgery and comes with risks. This procedure is minimally invasive. Pregnancy and childbirth. She's in labor. She's in the delivery room. She's had pregnancy complications in the past. You'll need prenatal care. Mental health crisis. She suffers from severe depression. He's had anxiety attacks. She's had psychotic episodes. We'll have to put her under a 24-hour watch. Other vocabulary. Bruising. A black eye. A sprain. A scratch. A cut. A gash. An earache. A fever. A bloody nose. A rash. Pink eye. A sore throat. Things you might need. Crutches. A cast. Wrap. Bandage. A splint. Gauze. A wheelchair. An eye patch. A sling. Individuals seek medical care to address their health concerns, receive appropriate treatment, 
and ensure their well-being. These are just a few things that you might need to know the next time you're at the hospital. This next video is on different types of doctors. Thanks for watching.